Hello and welcome to our weekly update. Uh, today is June the 27th. Uh, it's been a little bit longer than our regular se uh, seven day intervals. Um, we have some update to, uh, for you, but in the last week and a bit, we haven't, uh, it, things haven't been too exciting. We've decided um, on certain routes to take uh, for certain implementation. Uh, to start off, we've decided, uh, if you remember from our last update, um, we decided to go with a, uh, we were showing you the communication system that we're going to have between our devices. And uh, the one, the, the system that we're implementing right now, we're using just standard moment, uh, modem uh, functionality. And uh, we've come to the conclusion that um, this functionality isn't what we're looking for, isn't what, what's needed. So uh, last week, last update, I should say, we spoke, uh, we spoke on using flash memory and any time that there's a, a signal, that's when we're going to throw, throw the package and communicate. Uh, so our system, our communication system, we're going to change it up to um, cater to that, um, uh, to the communication system uh, that we described on um, on paper or uh, that we showed to you last week. Um, in other news, this is our ground station. Uh, if you remember, uh, this was you know in bits and pieces. Um, as you can tell, we got our breadboard in there. Uh, we don't have. Uh, the functionality yet we we will as soon as we finalize our communication system which by the way is gonna take we're hoping to change it up um, and we're hoping that in two two days to a week we'll have that system that switch so what we need here is just uh, to finally decide on our communication system and, and um, our, our, our protocol and uh, we're, we could start plugging away at this <clears throat> another thing that we um, have uh, kind of touched on and we've actually put this together um, more than a couple months back but uh, one of the things that we've uh, w that we've did uh, that we uh, kind of looked at when we started this whole project one of the requirements was how to uh, get um, public behind us you know how to how to bring awareness and one of the things we came up with was sending a puck to the moon and uh, you know especially especially in Canada it was you know it was the media got onto it uh, so that was that was our method um, what we've uh, what else what we've come up with we're trying to uh, generate some uh, cash flow at the same time we're trying to generate awareness for, of our team uh, we've actually started uh, doing uh, 3d printing of a mold and then uh, casting um, making silver coin out of it so this is the coin this is uh, our, our team logo on here this is our Lunaro this is the back which is actually the back side of the moon <laughs> but with this we hope to uh, get some uh, get some backing and with it we've kind of came up with an idea of um, coin uh, authentication through our site and I would actually love to touch that, uh, touch up uh, on that um, for one full update. Uh, just trying to go through the scenarios of what we're planning to do. And lastly, our what are, what are we been working on? Um, it seems like there's a bunch of projects, but a lot of them are um, we're we're doing research of how to. Um, make our implementation better or what we could use in the field. So one of the things that we're uh, working on, and I'm not going to go into great detail until it's finalized or proven, uh, proof of concept is done. Uh, we've been playing around with frequencies and we're trying to pick up, so we're, we've been doing the analog to digital conversion and we're trying to p pick up on certain frequencies and um, I hope in the future that, you know, I could speak more about uh, about this because it's actually uh, there is some excitement in that. Um, but thank you very much for tuning in again, and I will speak to you in a week.